Well, so I was the opening speaker this morning, um, and uh, I now basically, if Larry Chu invites me, then I come because he's <laughs> such a wonderful curator of interesting conferences and such a wonderful host. And he also um, prompts me to ask questions in um, the research that we do at the Pew Research Center that I think spark me to go in a new direction. And so when Larry calls, I answer. So that's what really why I'm here. But also because I think that self-tracking um, has enormous potential that people don't yet understand, which I think is an area that's really ripe for research. And who did you bring with you? So this is Gina Knapp, who we, and we were just talking about. She is a researcher that I've known for a decade. A decade. And um, talking about how um, each of us as internet researchers have, our paths have been brought together again, looking at self-tracking because it's so important. I'm, I'm at the University of Washington and Princeton University Center for Information Technology Policy. And I'm working on a study on how basically consumer health data is going to change the institutions of healthcare. So what does it mean when self-trackers bring in data to their clinicians and what are the clinicians going to do about it? There's on one hand a fantasy that this will seamlessly somehow magically be integrated into electronic medical records. But on the other, there's lots of issues, as Susanna brought up in her keynote, about privacy and sharing and control over the stories that patients want to tell about their own selves. Thank <laughs> you.